Shout out to Squarespace for sponsoring this video. Hey guys, how are you? It's Lindy and welcome to Crystal's Cooking Club. Where we make stuff and then put it in our mouth. <laughs> Sounds fun. Sounds fun. Right? Sounds fun. So uh, I made a vlog two weeks ago wherein I told you guys that I'm really into cooking. And for some reason everybody thought that I said I'm really into cocaine. Which <laughs> is not the thing, okay? Cocaine bad, cooking good. So <laughs> <laughs> That would be really wild though if we would just randomly say that I'm really into cocaine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But you guys really want me to make a cooking video, so that's what's going to happen today. And I also got my beautiful assistant with me. Today I'm going to make some vegan chicken wings made from jackfruit and a cauliflower bone. Great. Yeah. Wow. So uh, I found a recipe on the interwebs. I saw Julian Solomita make this recipe and I will leave it down below, but he got the recipe from someone else. So I'll leave all the information in the description box down below. So first thing we're going to do is, is wash your hands. That's probably the best thing to do. <laughs> I literally never wash my hands. <laughs> so, um, basically what you need to do is you need to get some jackfruit and then kind of like rip it. How do you say that? Shred it. And then you get chicken. People normally use like a knife, but I like to do it with my hands. Like this. And you only want to have like the this stuff and not the stem. So you can just toss that away and put it in something else. I'm just going to shred this. And then once it's all shredded, I'll be back. Because I'm pretty sure that this is going to take a while. So, yeah. Okay. I got my uh, jackfruit over here and now I'm going to squeeze as much water out as possible. So I'm just gonna put it in here again. E, 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 e. Okay, I don't know why I got this knife by the way because I haven't even used it. What I now need to do is something that I actually don't know. Let me just quickly <laughs> look up the recipe. And see what I need to do next. <laughs> okay, so now uh, we're going to make chicken stock. And I actually bought this thing, and this is the first time I'm using it, and there's like all this smoke coming from it. <laughs> so I hope our house is not going to burn down. So yeah, let me get some water. One and a half cup of water. One and a half. Oh my god. Okay, then I'm going to add some chicken stock. I honestly, I have no idea how much I'm supposed to use, so I'm just gonna wing it. Tablespoon? Nah, more. A teaspoon of onion powder. Just add some more, <laughs> whatever. And then two teaspoons of nutritional yeast. <laughs> One teaspoon. <laughs> two teaspoons. And then, oh my god, it's all moving so fast. And then 10 drops of liquid smoke. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, is that ten? <laughs> yeah. Doo -doo -doo. Okay, so now I'm going to take my chicken. Let me just get it. Mon chicken. And I'm gonna pull the... What's chicken in French? Pull, right? Yeah, I think so. More pull. <laughs> pull jackfruit. And I'm gonna have and to... And what's this Spanish? Pollo. German? Kipf. <laughs> <laughs> my <de> kipf. <laughs> this is my de talk talk. <laughs> and in Russian? Kiopa. <laughs> Let's just put our kip into the boiling water. Pablo, for Jesus Christ's sake, act like a normal cat. Okay, so 
put this in here. You do do do. Let's put this in the. Ow, hot. Okay, never mind. And then we're just gonna have to stir this around. Stir, stir, and then leave it be for 10 minutes. So. Oh my God! Watch out! You're gonna die! Oh Jesus! So annoying. He is so annoying. So basically, what you're gonna do is you're just gonna leave it in here, and then um, the jackfruit is gonna like soak up all the liquid. So then you have chicken flavored jackfruit. It doesn't really smell like chicken now, though. Let me just uh, let this in here for uh, about the 10 minutos. And then I'll be back. Oh no, wait. Well, this simmers, I can actually start on the cauliflower bone. Wow, such a multitasking talent. Yeah. Oh, that sounds disgusting. Cameraman working hard, as you can see. Yep. Does it look good? Nope. Okay. <laughs> We're now going to start on our beautiful uh, bone because chicken wings, of course, have bones in them. So we're actually going to use a beautiful cauliflower to use as the bone. So let's just take all this stuff off because we do not need that. Oh my god. Ta -dum, ta -dum, ta -dum, ta -dum, tum 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 Yeah, I'm just uh, taking all the leaves of this beautiful cauliflower. Cauliflower. Cauliflower sounds way better than Bloemkool. Yeah, Wait. it does. Bloemkool. Wat mocht je ermee? Let's cut this bad boy up. Ready? Ow! That was louder than I thought it was gonna be. So, uh, you need to have four stems because we're gonna make four chicken wings out of this stuff that is making a lot of noise right now. Four chicken wings? Four chicken wings! Well, you thought you were gonna have more? Yeah. Sorry, we're only gonna have four today. <laughs> so I hope you're not hungry because yeah, you're not gonna get, you're not gonna get any more. I'm gonna order some food right now. <laughs> By the way, if you're wondering, he's literally, literally like sitting on the ground right now <laughs> to get this beautiful shot right here. The dedication is real. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Does this look like the boat? <laughs> Nope. Nope. We're gonna use it anyways. Hey Lynn. <laughs> go, go, go. go up a little bit. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> now your head's between the cauliflowers. Hello. Yo. <laughs> Yo. Yeah. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, so much to do at the same time. I hope this is doing great as well. Wait. You got a timer on? I didn't even look at the time, so I bet you <laughs> it's like... <laughs> Let me just squish, squish, squish. I bet you get your, you're getting your own cooking channel on TV straight away. Yeah. Guy Fieri, watch out. I'm coming for you. Okay, everybody. Hey. Um, chicken is done. Uh, I put it on a plate so it could like cool down a little bit, but it's still a little bit hot. But whatever, we're just gonna pretend like it's not too hot for me. So, take some syringe wrap. Serene. Oh my god, what the? Go away! Or stay, but don't eat the food. You can stay. Don't eat. <laughs> Pablo. Pablo. He's in the tech mode. He's in the tech mode. Yes, there it goes. I love goes. you. I love you. And then, okay, you're gonna have to put it over here. And then you're gonna take one of your uh, chicken bones and use a fourth of the chicken stuff that you have, and then you're gonna make a wing out of it. Exciting. <laughs> so now you just have to sculpt this into a chicken wing. Oh my god! <laughs> How do they do this? This is 
is very difficult. You have such amazing talent. Thank you. Okay, um, I'm finally done with wrapping my chicken wings, which honestly it took so long to do. It was very difficult as well. And I still don't think that they're good right now. I feel like they have too much air in them. So they're just gonna like fall apart. But we'll just have to wait and see what's gonna happen. So what we are now going to do is we're going to take these and put them in the freezer for one hour. Okay, hello everybody. Um, it has been almost an hour. So now we're just going to make our uh, flour and egg concoction. So I got some spices over here. Uh, also I got my pan right now. Let me just add some oil to this. So I can uh, make uh, deep fry uh, stuff. I have actually never deep fried anything in my life. So I don't know how it works and I hope I'm going to do a good job. Ooh. So, my mixture. Got my spices here. Then we're gonna add some flour to it. Three quarters of a cup. Put this in here. And then we're gonna need some aquafaba, which is an egg replacer. And basically, it's just the liquid that comes in uh, chickpeas. So, that apparently is an egg replacer. So let me just open this up. Ow. Never heard of that. <laughs> Literally, I hurt my wrist when I was squeezing out the liquid from the jackfruit earlier on. <laughs> so use the liquid of one can and then you have some aquafaba. Aquafaba. We get uh, the chicken over here and you need to put it aquafaba. Flour, aquafaba, flour. And they said you need to work very fast because apparently if you put your chicken in the aquafaba, it starts falling apart. So, fun! Shit, put aquafaba. Aquafaba, aquafaba, okay. And then, put it in here. Oh my god, this is literally just gonna fall apart, I think. Aquafaba again. And then this stuff again. So, we're going to do one at a time. We're going to put it in there and then deep fry it. I'm so scared. I've never deep fried anything in my life before. So, let's see <laughs> how this is gonna go. Oh my god. I think I put way too much oil in this pan, it's gonna boil over. Oh! Oh my god, this is terrifying! Hello. Can I play with it? Yeah, you can move it around. So! Ooh, so, this is it! This is it! The moment of the truth! Okay, everybody! Here they are! Here they are! This was a wild ride! So, I really hope that they are not gonna disappoint because then I'm gonna get so incredibly mad! Me too! Cheers! Bon appétit! Let's see! They don't taste like chicken. No, but they do taste good. Yeah, but I, I thought it was gonna be... I mean, I've seen so many videos, well, I've seen three videos of people making these and their reaction was, oh my God, this is so good. It is good, it really is. I don't know, it's kinda, I feel like that the jackfruit is just too wet. I mean, chicken really isn't that moist. <laughs> this is what it looks like. On the inside. <coughs> so yeah. <laughs> so yeah. I felt like it was kind of a, an anti-climax, but it's not. I don't know. It's not. It's not really. A, it does taste good. Yeah. But it, it doesn't does. taste like chicken at all. And I really no. thought it was gonna taste like chicken. 
But the problem with like vegan chi uh, vegan chicken channels, but the problem with vegan cooking channels is that most of them have been vegan for like years. So they probably forgot what the chicken tastes like. So if they eat this, they're like, oh yeah, that's how chicken tastes like. That's Can. what I remember. I don't know, it's not... Mm, I think I will definitely be making them again. Yeah, they do taste good. They do taste very good. They don't and taste like chicken. They don't taste like chicken. You just don't know, you, you, you just shouldn't compare it to chicken. No, so if you give it a name like a wing. Yeah, but the thing is, I wanted to make chicken wings, yeah. so... Yeah, alright. So, yeah, yeah, I'm going to give it two Pablos. Two Pablos, alright. But it's still delicious. So, yeah. What are you gonna give? Well, I do like them, so I give them three Pablos. Three Pablos and a two for me. So yeah, guys. So this was my uh, first ever cooking video. Yay! Yay! <laughs> I hope you guys like it. I mean, I do. I really do like cooking. So I might I wanna hope. make more of these crystals cooking club. That's so fun. I can like make something, and then you guys can make it as well, and then we can. All cook together! Yay! <laughs> That'd be so much fun. So yeah, definitely let me know in the comments down below what you think of this. Ow. And if you want me to make more of these, <laughs> because then I'll definitely will be making more of these. And if you want me to make more of these, then also let me know what I should make. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please don't forget to give it a Thumbs up, 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 thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs up. Please don't forget to follow me on my Instagram because I would really appreciate that. So let's now just quickly talk about the sponsor of today's video. Today's video is sponsored by Squarespace. Squarespace. So what's Squarespace? What Squarespace is. Yes. Squarespace is an amazing all-in-one platform where you can build your own website. Mm. And Squarespace also has some amazing features that's going to make it even easier for you to build your own website. Like the traffic overview feature where you can track trends and page visits and views to better optimize your posting. And Squarespace also allows you to link various social media accounts to your website so you can post simultaneously to all accounts. So go to squarespace.com slash crystallindy to get a free trial and 10% off your first purchase. Wow. That is an amazing deal. That's an amazing deal. Of course, I will leave all the information and links in the description box down below. So yeah, thank you so much to Squarespace for sponsoring this video. And thank you guys for watching this video. And I really hope to see you in my next video. Yes. Bye. <laughs>